all right welcome once again for today's tutorial all right let's see what we can do for today we are in mass 112 calculus all right we are in a section of solving inequalities using sign charts all right now let's see the question for today is a find the range of values of x for which 3 plus x all over 1 minus 2x in bracket 2 plus x in bracket is less than 0 okay so you find the range of values of x for which 3 plus x all over 1 minus 2x in bracket 2 plus x is less than 0. Okay, now let's see what we're going to do. Okay, as you can see, this expression 3 plus x all over 1 minus 2x in bracket and then 2 plus x is less than 0. Okay. What we're going to do here is this. I want us to remove this denominator. We want it to be in one line. We want to remove fraction. Let it be linear. So what I'm going to do here is this. We are having 1 minus 2x in bracket 1, right? And then 2 plus x. So we're going to multiply both sides with the square of these two expressions that is 1 minus 2x square and then 2 plus x square that is all we're going to use to multiply both sides now let's see how it's going to be it will be 3 plus x all over 1 minus 2x in bracket 2 plus x in bracket times 1 minus 2x in bracket square and then 2 plus x in bracket square less than 0 so if you multiply 0 with any number at all it will still remain 0 so we don't waste time multiplying those sides too all right good now let's go we have this multiplication 1 minus 2x in the denominator we cancel 1 minus 2x but you remember that this is having two, right? Then one of them we go. And then we we'll have two plus x. We cancel one of two plus x square. All right? So at the end of the day, we'll end up having three plus x in bracket, one minus two x in bracket, two plus x in bracket. You get what we did, right? All these ones that have square, square. All right? We cancel one of them each, the remaining one. Okay? So that's why we have 3 plus x in bracket, 1 minus 2x in bracket, 2 plus x in bracket. Okay? Now, less than 0. Okay. Look at what we're going to do. Each of them will take this less than 0. So, we'll end up having 3 plus x less than 0 or... 1 minus 2x is less than 0, or 2 plus x is less than 0. Okay, let's remove the bracket. So we'll have 3 plus x less than 0, 1 minus 2x less than 0, 2 plus x less than 0. Okay, so we'll have x. We'll take 3 to the other side. It will be less than minus 3. And then we'll have minus 2 less than 0. So we'll take... 1 to the other side to be minus 1. So we'll have minus 2x less than minus 1. Then we'll have x. We take 2 to the other side. It will be x less than minus 2. Okay? Now let's go back to this middle number. We have minus 2x less than minus 1, right? We are looking for x, not minus 2x. So we divide both sides by minus 2. So we'll have minus 2x all over minus 2, less than minus 1, divided by minus 2. So we'll end up having x 
is less than 1 all over 2. So the minus we cancel minus. All right. So we end up having three values, which are x is less than minus 3, x is less than 1 all over 2, and then x is less than minus 2. All right. Okay. So I want you to go ahead and plot your 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 chart and then your number line and then do the necessary i hope you can do it right yes please it's not necessary that we'll be doing everything for you please try your hands we have several tutorials that we treated the sign chart the number line and everything we treated it about four to five times all right so and i'm very sure by now you are familiar with that so i know you can use the sign chart and then the number line then you can complete it all right okay thank you very much please keep watching keep practicing and then if you have not subscribed please sub Subscribe. Thank you.